Our producer then attempted to get answers to questions. I am not Bangladeshi, and the person you're talking about, I have no idea about their case. We're, we're that is the that. end of my statement. She then made an apparently threatening remark to our producer, who is pregnant. Thanks, Daisy, for coming. Hope you have a great birth, because child labour is hard. Julip Sadiq sits on the Women and Equality Select Committee in Parliament. The only reason she's ever given us for not helping Ahmad bin Qasim is that he's never lived in Hampstead. He's not a constituent. Yet this is what the MP apparently told a Bangladeshi online newspaper. You don't have to be in Bangladesh or England. I try to help Bangladeshis in England in whatever way it is possible. I travelled to Dhaka in November 2016 and I met with a number of diplomats there and asked them what could we do to free Amman. And what they told me was the person to speak to is Chulip Sadiq MP because all it would take, they said, is a phone call for, from her for him to be released. Tonight, mystery surrounds the whereabouts of Ahmad bin Qasim in Bangladesh. Mystery also surrounds the Hampstead MP who says she'll help Bangladeshis anywhere, but clearly won't in this case.